Hey guys, what's happening? Today, I'm, this is episode 6, I believe, of my weapon reviews. Today I will be reviewing the Model 1887s, which are, is a lever-action shotgun and is unlocked at level 68 or something like that. And this is after the patch, which, like, brung down the range. My perks are Marathon Pro, Stopping Power Pro, and Steady Aim Pro. Now, I do hate these guns. But look at this. I get a nice first blood there. A very nice first blood. Anyway, um, as I was saying, I really hate these guns. Simply because... Well, I used to love them before the patch, because they could go miles. But a lot of wingy kids... Yeah, they did go too bad, but a lot of wingy kids like... Oh no, it's killing me. What do I do? What do I do? They're killing me. Um, so they bring the range down. Yeah, it was a bit crazy, but now I've just made them absolutely shit. I mean, they were unlocked to level 68. They should be a bit good, shouldn't they, really? Come on. So, anyway. When it comes to reloading these guns... Look, wait, wait. Yeah, when it comes to reloading these guns, they are very quick to reload. But look, when you sprint with guns, it gives these guns an erection. They just suddenly shoot up in the air. Look, witchy. Noob. Anyway, you can fire one at a time, which is not too bad, really. I mean, I like that. But why does he spin around to reload? It just makes it look real like Terminator. Bounce shot. Um, the accuracy on these guns is very good, actually. It's only because it's got a low fire rate. That's why it's very good accuracy. But it has got a very big crosshair. Almost like the size of a sniper's. Even after the patch, it's still got some pretty sweet damage on it. Some very nice damage. Not to say some not too bad range either. But still, they, they bring it down way too much. I mean, it should be at least the same or more as the spas. Because you unlock it at such a late level. What's point in getting the best gun first? Yeah. Apart from it gives you a reason to prestige. Um, this is a lever action gun, which makes it, so when you fire a bullet, when you have to cock it, yes I said cock, ha ha ha, you have to Enemy care either incoming. pull the lever down, then pull it back up, or just do what this guy does and spin it around. But if you get these in real life, please don't spin them around. No, in fact, do and put it on YouTube, bit funny. When, these don't even look the same in real life, I've been looking at someone in real life, because my dad's about to buy a shotgun. He just got his license through. So I've been looking at some. And they've got a huge stock on them. I'm wondering like, if you can take that off or something. But as you notice, when you reload this, they have blue shells instead of red shells. I don't know what that means. I don't know if it's a different type. Like lower recoil, higher recoil. Look at the recoil on these ones though. What? Well, only a hit marker. Pathetic. I think you get seven bullets in the thing if I can count properly. Oh, very nice. That was a very nice kill. You get seven bullets in the thing, you get Enemy 42 with it, but coming. I hardly ever reload this gun. Because by the time you fired off seven shots, you, they should have like, been dead already. Unless something like that happens. I think I get a really nice throw and I kill you. Look, what did you... Boom! Yeah, that deserves five star. That deserves rating five star. Doesn't it? What's this guy doing? Sit down, you. Glad my throwing knife back, thank you. Boom! Sit down. Oh god, I'm awesome with you. I die here, though. Wait, do I? Yeah, I do. Look! How? What? Seriously, come on. What? Anyway, this is the last of my shotgun reviews. If you want more reviews from me, which I'm sure you do, because you love me, um. I'm such a noob. If you want more reviews from me, just say, like, do you want pistol reviews, um, machine pistol reviews, some machine gun reviews, just stuff like that. Ooh, rocket launcher, stuff like that. Launcher reviews, that'd be quite good to do. When you start using these guns, I mean, I hated it, but they're alright. They are really fun to use. But they do they are, look retarded. Especially when it makes your guy run, it's like... When it runs, it's kind of like... Boom. 
And we're back. It, why are you sticking with an air cat? You're normal. I don't know what it looks like from like someone else's point of view. I don't think I've ever seen anyone running around with models like that. Boom, sit down for my four kill streak. I think this is my care package fail here. Well, it's pretty much a fail because of the range of these shotguns. And I'll tell you why it's a fail because of the range in a second look. So I bring down my predator here. I don't think I get any kills. Oh, we got reloaded. Right. Bring up my little laptop. No. Well, I might get some kills. No. Because them two die. So I come up here. Oh, no. No kills. Fail. And I bring my care package in. This is where it kind of gets shit. So you get a hit marker there. He knives me. So I'm sprinting back like, no, 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 my care package. My care package. See the guy? I see him laying down. Go for shot. Too far away, come on, what? And then I get killed because I'm angry. I am playing on PS3 for any of you who don't know. Because they're much better than Xbox. No, I'm only joking, they're both the same. Anyway. So. I ain't got much to say really, these are pretty good guns, they're good. Oh, I really should have seen him. They got very nice damage, very nice range. Well, not very nice range really. They used to have really nice range. There's some cocks could complain about it. But that's a different story. Anyway, the fire rate, on the statistics where you see your things, it's extremely low. I'm just looking at them now, it's like... No, they're not that low, so you can just go, you can fire one. And then fire the other. And then that, by the time you fight over, the other one will spawn around, so you can just carry on going, go boom, 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 boom. But you'd have to be pretty retarded. And you'd look like a dad, dude. And you'd have to reload all the time. Who's <sighs> using this? There's no one like. Don't add any of these people to your friends list, please don't. Add me, jump. I hate that camper there. Boom, sit down. That's what I like about painkiller. He keeps copying my class through this whole game. No one else hit it when people copy your class like that. Sit down. I'm just looking at this now, it's a bit over 10 minutes. So I may have to. I may have to speed up, I have a speed up the video just like a little bit or just cut a bit off the end. Fail. Stupid tree got in the way. I could have had five care packages though. So, because this is the last one, I'll tell you which one I think is the best shotgun on the game. For range, I'd go for the. Not these, I'd go for the SPAS 12, obviously the best for range. But for sheer fun and getting lots of easy kills, very nice, I'd go for the Striker. I just really like it, it's semi automatic single fire, very nice fire rate, very nice range, good damage, very good accuracy. But the eye attack's going to be bad. Right, I'm trying to get up here now, because you can get up there. I don't, th I don't think anyone's put it up on YouTube yet, but I can't be bothered putting it up. And if you want extremely immense fire rate, but no ammo, go for the A12. If you just want to look like a retard running around with you, you're going to stuck it in the go for this gun. But you do get some fun kills. And just steer clear of the M1014. Well, it is a good looking gun. It's very easy to get some nice kills with it. Just, there's better guns out there for it. Boom, headshot. Can I get another headshot? Boom, nice headshot there. Is my blowing annoying you? That sounds wrong, doesn't it? Yes. Sorry. <laughs> I can't believe I just said that. Is my blowing annoying you? I 
apparently when you get the models with FMG, it makes them as good as they were before, but I haven't got that because really I can't be asked. I never use them, but it's a newbish gun to use. Anyway, this review is nearly over, so thank you for watching and subscribe, rate and comment for more. And my Ranger review has just rendered, so I'm out. Bye.